Yo, King AK47, Voice of the Streets, man. Shout out to the game, man. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Let me give you some time to hit the like button. All right, I appreciate y'all for hitting that like button, man. A um, couple things I want to talk about. Uh, people wanted me to re-elaborate clearly about the live yesterday, talking about this dirt home invasion shit. All right, there's <clears throat> a couple red flags in this. Now, before I say this, I'm not saying this is 100% fact. This is my opinion, goddammit. And y'all can comment off my opinion and see how y'all feel. But I'm going to highlight the red flags in this shit and, 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 and try to figure out, is this a promotional scheme or what's going on? All right, boom. Academics breaks this story, right? No, before academics breaks this story, this happens damn near immediately after the King Von paperwork dropped about killing K.I., right? So that had everybody thinking, oh, the feds coming, the feds coming. They coming, because while the paperwork dropped, right? Boom, right after that, academics report that Dirk had a home invasion and the feds was there. There was a heavy police presence. presence. He say the neighbors contacted him. One red flag about that is, so the neighbors contacted you, and none of the neighbors ended up calling the police, because the police was called by uh, individuals that was inside of Dirk's home. Y'all can look it, read it, look it up, it's right there. So, that's a red flag. That make you wonder, hmm, who really reached out to you and told you about this situation, academics? Was it the neighbors? Or it could have been somebody at Dirk Camp. All right, let's continue. So when he said there was heavy police presence, the feds was there, home was raided, possibility that the home was raided, that started a whole day of speculation. OTF going to jail. Dirk about to go to jail. FBG Duck, they about to get him. They about to get him. That was a whole day, right? Day two, that shit disappears. And... It said that, oh, and mind you, the feds never was there. It was just regular police. So we're going to skip to day two. Everybody telling motherfucking academics to, um, you know, uh, mind your business. DJ, uh, 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 what the hell is the DJ name? I keep it. DJ Bands, Dark, uh, Dark Entourage said, man, mind your business. Memo posted everybody mind their business, right? So that gives you the impression, right, that, okay, nobody from Dirk's camp is talking to academics. They ain't fucking with them. They ain't giving them no information, right? So a tweet comes from academics, and he says, I respect Dirk because he's not like other rappers and run with real-life shit happening and turning it into an album or promotion, which was a goddamn lie because all Dirk was doing after that, yeah, he posted a picture of him sitting on the counter with his girl facing the goddamn wall, and um, he been promoting the show that happened last night. He been promoting that show like a motherfucker since it happened. So, academics, you lied. Uh, nigga, he been promoting, even before you made that post, he was promoting the show. Then he said, Name another rapper uh, that wouldn't be shooting with his girl at the ops and not trying to reenact it or, or posting about it. Uh, academics, who the fuck told you that this nigga was shooting at the ops? The police reports clearly say if anybody, unknown individuals, that means the police don't know who the fuck did it. Now, if they telling you to mind your business, they ain't telling you shit. Right? They telling you to mind your motherfucking business. So they not going to tell you if Dirk was shooting at no ops. If the police didn't, don't know who them motherfuckers was. And if the niggas that's in Dirk camp told you to mind your business, how the fuck you know this nigga was shooting at ops? Ah. Million dollar question. How did DJ Academic, how was he able to come out and make a tweet and say, Name some other rappers that if him and they girl was in a shootout shooting at the ops, wouldn't reenact it or, 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 or run with it for clout. 
uh, academics, how the fuck do you know? Or was you supposed to be told to say that shit? Just like everything else you was told to say. Just like how you broke the news and tried to blame it on some motherfucking neighbors. Where? Where the proof? We ain't seen no emails. We ain't seen no messages. Hell, we don't know if the neighbor sent you a goddamn thing. So who reached out to you? Now, nah, with that in mind, I see Sadie make a video and he says somebody in OTF reached out to him. Now, this was before the situation. Uh, the same motherfucker, this is no lie. The same motherfucker tried to reach out to me. Now, y'all know after that re situation, I'm done with shit like that. If you don't already hit me up, I'm cool. It ain't never happened to Seti before. So around the same time, when these motherfuckers told Seti to report that Dirk was bagging away from OTF, they tried to get me to report that shit as well. So it got me extra thinking like, damn, if these niggas will reach out to us and we're the media, they would reach out to academics. Okay. So Seti posts this shit. It blows up. Blows up. Uh, 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 Muwak comments under a picture that Dirk posts, promote money and shit, and says, if you ain't OTF or if you ain't motherfucking O Block, it's fuck you. So what that does is that make said he look crazy. Th thank God I didn't post the shit because they did try to be. Now, mind you, this was before, before this shooting shit was supposed to have happened. I hope y'all stand with me. So it seemed like it was already planned up because ever since motherfucker tried to reach out to me and actually reach out to Seti, it been just all this shit. All right, cool. So we got all that, right? How the fuck the academics know that shit? That Dirk was shooting at the ops? I want to ask y'all. There's no proof that a shootout with some unidentified men actually happened. Okay? They talking about if anybody needs, uh, 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 if anybody has any details or anything. When they say shit like that, nobody died. They'll put a video on. So why ain't no video? Like, there's just no video. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, uh, I know Dirk had cameras everywhere or was they off. Why there's no video? If the police want help identifying the motherfucking intruders, the police will put that camera footage out of the motherfucking intruders. There's none of that. You can tell the police anything you really want to tell them. And you can also tell academics anything you want to tell them. Not saying the shooting didn't occur or nothing. All I'm saying is it could have been a Go outside, babe. Bah! Once in the air. Or, 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 or go outside, uh, whoop -de whoop We all about to bah bah. The police, the, 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 uh, the damn phone call to the police came from Dirk House. So the shooting happened at Dirk House. The police got called by Dirk House. It seemed a little strange. Then, to top it all off, all this shit started with Bob, right? So right before the show, this nigga drops a picture. Now, mind you, all this shootout shit, all this shit started with Dirk. I mean, with, uh, goddamn, uh, King Vine. So, he ups this picture. With help, money, and King Vine. Now, let me just ask y'all something. Not, I said, like I said, I'm not saying that it didn't happen. I'm just saying these are red fucking flags. What is the coincidence that Vine... You know, basically, paperwork drop. Right after that, this shooting happens. So everybody thinks they released Vine paperwork and, and Dirt just got the feds blew down at their house. Mind you, the feds was never there. It was regular police. How it go in with Vine? It start with Vine and end with Vine. So all I'm going to say is this. Dirt, if you really went through that shit, you know, I wish you well. It don't look like it. All you've been doing is promoting. Uh, it ain't no, no, I'm cool, y'all. None of that shit. No, nobody get none of that. It's just promoting down a motherfucking throat about this goddamn show. And even more shows. Just promotion, 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 promotion. 
academics. What do you know about this shit? Did you get paid? You was before TMZ. You was before the fucking news stations. You was before everything. How do we know that neighbors reached out to you? These niggas reached out to niggas like Sadie and me and tried to throw some shit at us. Academics, do you even know what you was reporting? Come on now, we in, we in the hood. You ain't got to tell the police the truth all the time. Oh, what happened here? Nigga, gun might have went off on accident. Foul. You know the police gonna come. Damn. You know that bitch. So, hold on. Uh, babe, go outside and shoot one time. Bow. Uh, let me go shoot one time. Bow. Uh, shit. Call the police, y'all, so it can make it seem like we, we gotta call the police first. Uh, Fuck it. Let's just say some niggas try to come in this bitch. Kick down the door. Boom. Uh, uh, I'm just saying, man, before we even start running with shit, this shit happened to me once. I ain't falling for it again. It seemed like some big promotional shit. You know what I mean? And if it really happened, motherfuckers capitalizing off this shit like it's really a good thing. Posting money. Yeah, I'm the voice of the trick. Like this shit cool. To show other niggas like, come on, man. So I don't know. I just break it down some red flags to y'all about the shit. I wasn't gonna do this video, but it was so many people from the live stream saying, "Damn, AK, I ain't thinking about it like that." You right, and I just had to come through and break it down out my eyes how I feel about the situation. When you sit back and take a deep motherfucking breath and you start analyzing shit, like, "Damn, what was DJ Academics' role? Damn, how the fuck did he know they were shooting at ops? Like, how?" That's a million dollar question I want everybody to ask academics. He cannot say, oh, I was just insinuating. You can't do that when you this big ass media platform, nigga. You cannot insinuate that he was just shooting that out. That means somebody told you he was shooting that out. The only people that could have told you he was shooting that out is Dirt Camp. So if Dirt Camp told you or whoever the fuck told you that Dirk and his girl was shooting at Ops. What the fuck did they tell you in the first place? Did, were they the ones to reach out to you to make you bring out this motherfucking story? I mean, what's going on here? You see what I'm saying? I do shit like this because I feel like fans of these niggas, diehard fans of these motherfuckers, a lot of y'all are kill over these niggas. A lot of y'all are cry over these niggas. Last thing we need is motherfuckers to be brainwashed and get tricked on and played on for some motherfucking promotion, my nigga. You feel what I'm saying? So, uh, y'all leave it in the comment section, man. How y'all feel about that shit? No ballistics, nothing. We don't know shit. And it wasn't even never no feds there. So with academics paid to promote this shit the way he promoted it, he was the first one with an update. How, nigga? If they told you to mind your business, how are you continuing to know what the fuck is going on? They not telling you shit, right? Y'all let me know in the comment section. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you ain't subscribed. Share this video, man. King AK47, Voice of the Streets, man. I'm out. I'll see y'all on the live stream. I might have another video upload after this. I done fucked up my notification. I was supposed to upload two videos. and Fucked it up in the video and uploaded another video that had no sound. So I done fucked up my notification. So... I probably just see y'all tonight on the live stream, man. I see y'all in a minute. Y'all let me know in the comment section how y'all feel about this shit. And uh, the biggest question out of this is, how the fuck did DJ Academics know Dirk and his girl India was shooting at the ops? If the police don't even know that shit, and if they told you to mind your motherfucking business, how did you get that information? I'm out.